Hi guys, welcome to another um, video. This one is a showcase and tutorial of my automatic storage system. So, let's go and test it out. So, how to operate it, you need to go on the orange right here. And then on the yellow. And then you can throw up to five different kinds of items. Or no less than five stacks. So, just throw your items in immediately go away make sure they're right center on the piston before pushing the button there it is and then, and then if you look right here right there they're going in one at a time these have already been there so pretty much I was just testing them out so I'm just going to leave them in there. So, now I'm going to show you the steps on what you're going to need and to building it. So step one, you're going to build your inputs with your button T flip flop, here's for your retracting circuit. Step two, you're gonna build your extending circuit. And then, actually, no, step two, that's sorry, step two. Step three, you're gonna build your, retrac your retraction circuit. And step four, build your actual storage. So, here there, there were the steps, and let's get to it. Now we're going to go over to step one, but first, here's what you're going to need. Repeaters, redstone, blocks of redstone, any block, a building block, whatever, a sticky pistons, button, and redstone torches. So now that you have those, what you're going to start off with, uh, place your input, a block with the buttons, then run three to the side, off to a block with redstone on top, and from here you're going to build your T-flip flop. If you don't know how to build a T flip flop, you're going to put a uh, sticky piston right here and another right here. Break either one of these two blocks. I'm going to break this one. You're going to put your torch here, not on the edge, but right in the middle here. Then you're going to put a block either here or here. doesn't matter. I'm putting it here. This setting will be off. So then you're going to put two blocks right here, right on top. And you're going to run redstone here, torch on this side, and the torch on the other side. Now for the retraction system input, we're going to put two repeaters, both on four ticks. Run redstone around here. Another repeater on four ticks. Then run redstone here. And then another two repeaters on four ticks. Off to a block with... Uh, repeater on the side with four ticks. That will be your input, but you will need to toggle it. So you're going to put a piston here. And then... And then um, what you're going to do is... From here you're going to build right here. Actually you're going to go here. Sorry. One redstone off to a block. And a repeater on a single tick with redstone on the side. And a torch. Wait. Oh yeah, th then you are uh, here. So this is a toggle for the retraction circuit. And now you're done with your input circuit. Let's go to the next step. Now for the next step. on two ticks and another redstone. Then you're going to build three blocks up just like this. And then the third one. Run redstone across here. Then go two blocks out and another one here. 
Peter on two ticks, another on one, and redstone here. Actually, from this torch, you're going to need to throw redstone, and then your six piston. There it is. Oh, and from here, you're going to um, put a piston, uh, not, not a button, another piston. Put a redstone block, actually, we're going to do that later. But make sure that y the block is two blocks away from the sticky piston. And you're going to go continue on until... Oops, delete those ones. Because you're not going to need them. And then you're going to need five. So that's the fifth one. One, two, three, four, five. So that's what you need. They're all two blocks away from each other. And put a redstone block on all of them. Next thing you want to do is off to, off to this piston, you go off to a block. And then a block on top of the repeater. Redstone on top. Yeah, redstone on top, and then more redstone, and then run it that way. Oops. And right here, you're going to put your repeater on a single tick, and then your redstone. Then you're going to go another block, and a repeater on two ticks, off to a block with redstone on top, and off to a block on top of the repeater, and you get the point. Just make sure not to cut the power like this. Make sure you go up a block and delete this one so that the power is not cut. Then the rest down here. And then go up there. Repeater on a single tick. And then your redstone. Another block. Repeater on two. You already get the point. I'm going to say it again in case you didn't. Off to a block on top of the repeater. Redstone on both. Go up and up. Redstone. And finally, we're at Peter on a single tick. Oh, yeah, we have one more. I don't think I should uh, tell you guys exactly what to do because. If you forgot, you just either follow what I'm doing right now. Since I've shown it so many times on the other. Again. Put one in. And there you have it. You have your extending circuit. And let's test it out. As for the retraction system we need, because with the pistons, they're all two blocks away from each other. And you don't want that. So just replace those pistons back. There you go. And they're okay now. Now the next thing we're going to start building is the retraction system. First, we're going to do from the left side and the back. S but some of the right side right here is also part of the retraction circuit. But it's just especially part of the extending circuit. Now we're going to start from the left side. We're going to build. We're going to start with the pistons. Go up five of them. You're going to need five of them again. Except right here, they're a little more. Wait a minute. Oh, I put six. I only need five. But pretty much this is how you would get. Like this one, and then this one is two, a little two blocks lower. Oops. Powered that one. Put our redstone block not between, but on the pistons. And then you have your actual pistons for your retraction circuit. Then the next thing you want to off this repeater on the input for the retraction system go off to a block with a torch on the side 
and then after that go wait oh sorry the torch is supposed to go here and then the quartz block the uh, torch block torch wait we got another oh okay torch a block and another torch up to a block with redstone on top from here you're going to build it up just like this you must copy this L looking pattern and run the redstone across with nothing else for this one you're going to build one block off then one block out and up and you're going to go here oops sorry you're going to go redstone more redstone and then a repeater on four ticks and then the redstone here. Oh, and the ne next thing is um, you go from this light torch, go the other way, repeater on four ticks, off to a block with redstone on top, and off to a block with torch on the side, just like this. Then you're gonna go like that. So you're gonna go three blocks away and redstone. And then you're gonna go from this piston and the blocks here. And then you're gonna run the redstone. Or actually go um this way. Sorry about that. And do those. Oh, and for this one, it is another repeater on four ticks. Before you can run the redstone across, right here. Until this block powering that one. So now from here, you're going to go back down to the input. Go back to this block. Go um, two blocks out with the redstone, another three. And then a repeater on four ticks. Redstone here. And three more repeaters on four which I'll go off to a block with a torch on the side another block, torch on top on top, torch on top and another torch on top last one you put redstone on it now you're going to start building the back side for the piston so from this piston right here you're gonna go two blocks out but delete the very bottom block Do, and then go like that so you're pretty much having um, these blocks, they, they're all stagger. Um. Okay. Yeah, I think that's enough, is it? Or I think I only need four. Yeah, I only need four, sorry. So then from this block with the redstone on top, you're going to make another L shape. And run the redstone across just like this. And from this one, you're going to make the same L shape. Except you're going to put a repeater on four ticks from here. After the redstone, and run it over. Actually, um, yeah, put the blocks of redstone on it and then um, after this right here you're going to put another block with a repeater on four another block with redstone and then you go up two blocks then you're gonna go three blocks out like that and then you're gonna go one, two, three, four. Actually, about this repeater, um, you should actually... This is supposed to be the repeater, and that's redstone. And you're gonna go... Oh, there. And then you go up another block. I think I'm stuck there. And then for the redstone, you're gonna 
go up two blocks uh, like this with the redstone. For the repeaters, you're gonna have two on four, one in front of another, and then redstone across here. Repeater on one, redstone, repeater on a single tick, and run the redstone here, and cut the power here. Then from this block, where in between these two repeaters, you're gonna go down a block, down a block that way. Oops, that way, and another that way. Then you're gonna go down this way, and another down that way. You're gonna go three more out, and then you're gonna go wait until this redstone block right here, and another just where the piston is. For the wiring, you're just gonna run redstone all down here until here. Then a repeater on four ticks, and another on two ticks, and then <laughs> and then you have it linked to this piston. And from here, you're gonna go up a block. Then another out, and then you're gonna go like this. Two more blocks out this side, and then go all the way to this piston. You're gonna run redstone here. A repeater. Um, wait. Oh yeah, and then you need to build the uh, the one second delay. So this counts. So you need a full second of delay. So I'm using three repeaters for this. Two on four and one on two. If you want, you could do two on three and one on four. I don't care. Do whatever you want as long as the tick total would be ten or one second. Then you're going to run the redstone to here. Okay, so now after this, you're going to go one block out. Then one block out like this. A block on top of this repeater. And then, oh wait, actually... You're going to go off one block, and then you're going to go up, just like this, and then up another block, and you're going to go one block like this. Actually, it'll go up like that. Delete this one. Go here. And then run the redstone all across here. And then um, build up one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then you're gonna put three repeaters, one on two, another on three, and then another on four. You're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven with redstone. Next thing you're gonna do is um go two blocks out, two down, another out, and then for the wiring, you're going to go to here and there. And here you put a repeater on one tick. Go another block out and then one, two, three, four. Okay, sorry. So four more blocks out like that and then one here. And then you're going to run the redstone all across those blocks. Then what you're going to do is, from this second block, you're going to go down, another block out that way, another just out, go down, and down. So there, and then I run the redstone here, there. Actually, it's best I make it today. There. And then you're going to go to this block right here. Go one block out, another block down, one out. Go down and out that way. And then you're going to go four blocks here. Run the breadstone here. All here. And then, then you're going to go another redstone out. And then another ten, uh, ten tick delay. One second. So four, four, and two. So 
see those repeaters and then you're gonna go redstone here so from here you're gonna go one out and up go three blocks and then let's go off to a block and another three blocks out which go off to a block and then another so it should look like this then after that what you're going to do is redstone repeater on four another on one three repeaters all on one which all go off to this block and from here you're gonna go redstone and then three blocks out like this actually out of these three blocks this one needs to go up and here is going to be a repeater on a single tick redstone more redstone and then run it across until here actually they'll ju be just below you know go out like this and three repeaters all on four ticks there then after that you're gonna go one block up and you're gonna go until here or if you actually go until here then you're gonna go off right here repeater on one tick here and redstone here then you're gonna go off to this block two repeaters on four ticks go one redstone another repeater on four ticks there and another on four ticks and the rest on here and it will go off to three blocks two oops three go one block out they will all go what the hell's wrong with that bat then you're gonna run the redstone here then from here you're gonna go one two three four five blocks all the way until here make another one second delay r repeater on two and two more repeaters on four and then just run the redstone across here and then from here we're gonna go right here and we're gonna go two blocks out a repeater on two ticks redstone two more oops okay there and then wait three four five six seven okay th and then that side one two three four five six and then you're gonna go one and two these are the two repeaters and then run the redstone all across here and you're gonna go one block down actually gonna put this on top right there and then another right here actually yeah, a block here, and a block just right under. Okay. I guess now we could uh, try testing it out, I guess. So there were uh, the system, as always, and then... For the retract. Oh, so close. So close. I'm gonna have to try to find what I did. And then get back to you. So I saw what I um, did wrong, so here's the front. So you can easily navigate, and then you're going to go right here, 
I realized that this was actually supposed to be the redstone, and then this, the repeater, so that this can actually be powered. Now let's try. And of course the extension works. How about the retraction? It works. So um now for the last step what you're going to do is um press the button, let it be powered. Then just in here and then there. So this is just to you know to help you build it. Then uh, put the piston right there. And then from here, you're going to go here. Put another block. The and then the repeater, but this one, instead of two ticks, is going to go four ticks. It's going to go off to a block with redstone. However, it needs to go out this way so that it doesn't interfere with the extension circuit. Then you're going to go up. Hold on, from here you're going to go one, two, three, four, five, up. And then you're going to go... All the way to here. And then you're going to go until here. And run the redstone all across here. A repeater on one tick. And then so the redstone all the way to here. And that's how you begin your storage. And the next thing you're going to do is um, get some hoppers. Oops, not minecarts, hoppers. You're going to put one uh, right here. But you're not exactly going to be um, using it here. So then, um, wait. So you're going to put a hopper on that last piston right here. You're going to go up, hold shift, and then right click on that piston. And then delete. Oops, I deleted the wrong piston. So again, hold shift, click on the piston, and delete this piston right here. And you're going to need a chest as well. And then you're going to hold shift and put the chest right at the bottom. And there you have it. All you need to do is um, build this big storage thing to prevent anything from falling off. So... What you're going to start off doing is you're going to, for everything you're going to, so if everything is pushed up, they're going to, you're going to put your block right here, everywhere. Actually, you're going to let it go. You're going to put blocks like this and like that. Otherwise, if you put it here, it'll interfere with the whole system. And you'll put in a redstone. So pretty much what you do, red, um, block here, a block here, two blocks here, delete this one, two blocks here, and delete this one. And then, and then you already have, um, okay, sorry. And then you're going to go to here, delete this one, to here, delete that one. Just so that nothing falls off. And then right here you can go do that same thing. Except you go here so it doesn't interfere. Right here, delete it. Right here, delete this one. And then you have your system. But you're also going to need to move this up like that. Actually, you better put a block right here on the corner. And then after that, you are, um, if you want to build a staircase later, you can, but, you know, if you want, I can go through the storage right now. So you're 
gonna go like this. Four blocks off of the chest. Four more blocks here. And then eight blocks right here. And then go until here. Four more blocks. Like that. And then just build it inside. Oh yeah, well from here you're gonna put one more blocks, and then from here another eight. And then you're gonna bring this over right here, build it right here, and then starting to build from the inside you're going to, sorry about that, ah. And then you're going to build it inside, just like this. Yes, I'm building something, yes, I'm building a um, storage so that it does not look like mine because, because I don't know an exact tutorial on how to make this diamond looking thing. So I just decided to make it a rectangle. But I don't know if it's a square or not. I don't care either. But then what you're going to do is, um, you're just going to build it all inside. And then you're going to go up, just like this. Up a block. And then here, right there. So pretty much you're, um, building it right until here. And then build everything inside, right here. I'll get back to you when, um, actually, oh yeah, wait, I needed to. And then this, and then I'll get back to you when I am, uh, done. But if you want, I could just, but I'd rather not, but if you want to cover this up, I need to show you how not to and how you should. So you're not supposed to put any blocks here or it'll interfere with this. So you're just gonna put a block right here. So it doesn't interfere with this or any of this uh, redstone thing. And you're gonna put right, oh, don't put it on the hopper either. Otherwise it will not fall in. So there it is, done with it. Little rectangle thing. And then after that I'm gonna Actually, wh what's best that you do is, um, so, let me get some wool, yellow, and orange. So for this block right here, you're going to replace it with yellow, so that this is um, a reminder that it's a drop-off spot. The orange is the warning spot. So you will need to definitely get away from the orange, and then you could just build your staircase if you wish to. And then when you're done building your staircase, you could just go to the drop-off zone. But for this, you can only drop five different kinds of blocks because of the hopper, and that's the way it works. So I'm going to test it out. I'm actually, and it has to be no less, uh, it has to be no more than five stacks of the block. So I'm going to put oak wood, spruce wood, bedrock. Um, sand, and red sand. There you go. And what you're going to do is hold shift, make sure it's right centered. Then uh, you hold the cursor so that it's right here, just right here. Oops, sorry about that.
There you go. And then you're going to drop off your items. And I'm mistakenly picking them up. Oh yeah, actually I need to face them this way. And then drop them off. So they're all centered up. And then all you do is press this button. And let's go look inside. Hold on a second. Uh oh. Oh, there it is. Sorry about that. I was supposed to look for the chest. Sorry about that. And then just break these blocks. And then those. And then cover the hopper. Cover those blocks. And look at the hopper. It has all kinds. So all the bedrock is there, now the red sand. So all the five are there. Wait. Oh, yeah. Wait, only four were there. Where's the other one? I don't know. Sometimes it doesn't work, but um usually there um I tried five and it worked. This one one kind of block fell out. I guess. So pretty much Oops. I just broke the chest. Now I'm gonna have to do the hopper thing again. Sorry about that. Start here. Sorry. The chest. But you get the point. It actually works. You know, just as long as you center all everything into the piston. Because what I realized is when I put a stack of, um, what was that, the, um, the oak wood, it was actually not centered in the pistons, and then, um, and it didn't work for that one. But if you center everything, then you can close blocks. No less than a, a stack of six or uh, five stacks, sorry. Either no less than five stacks or five different kinds of blocks. So if you want to put five stacks of 64 diamonds still, because that's all the hopper could hold. But, um, thank you for uh, watching this tutorial. Um, subscribe for um, some updates. About this uh, fast one, it's not really for every single computer if you have a really really slow computer and this is not for you because you're gonna get a lot of lag spikes which will interfere with the whole thing I will make um, a universal version for all computers no matter how laggy they are and I'll also make some sort of returner um, which which um, I could also make it return some block back but, you know, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on my updates.